So, Logan Paul is being ratioed on Twitter by Tommy in it. And not even on Twitter, it actually grew past Twitter. I'm talking about this because I, 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 fi I find it interesting and I find it hilarious of, of, of what Tommy in it did. This drama actually begins with Tommy in it going on Twitter and saying, All right, I'm done. In the middle of watching, uh, one of logan paul's videos specifically it's his podcast in the middle of talking about the gaza conflict he he's holding up a prime bottle like yeah it's 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 awful he is spineless i it's it's i don't know how people haven't picked up on this yet i mean his brain is punctured with a bunch of holes his brain is not complete he literally cannot feel sympathy at all so you can see why all the other situations that have happened, happened. And there's been a lot. Anyway, after Tommy and it said that, Logan Paul replied with, The offline uh, glazing is, is crazy! And uh, posted, at this a screenshot? Destroy him, Logan. You got Tommy in its full faith. That was incredible. Thank you, boss. Hey, Logan, hope you're well post-fight. It was fucking awesome to watch, man. I'm just wondering if you're around soon for a call. I'd really love to learn some more of you and ask you some good questions, mate. Logan Paul doesn't reply because he's an asshole. Or, or just busy. Or just, or just busy. Or just busy. No video was fucking awesome, mate. Ah, thank you, G. I read that as, aw, thank you, G. Like he was going to be like, oh, thank you, Pookie. But uh, yeah, it was it, the, the, he, he he posts that screenshot as if it's as if it's like him winning, but it's just him being nice. He's just a nice guy, a nice little lad. And Tommy in it replies to this with, "If the same week I had a daughter, I also lost beef with Tommy in it, I would kill myself, which anyone would. I'm gonna be honest, I would do that. I would." I would kill, but yeah, it's just him being nice. I, I mean, I, he's just a nice little fella. He's a, he's a nice guy. Tommy Inn is one of the last remaining respectful people from the Dream SMP. He, he, he's a, he's a fully grown man, and he's, and he's, and he's going on tour, showing people how he got famous and how you can too. He's, he's, he's such a, he's such a nice guy. He just, he just can't help but compliment everyone, even Logan Paul. And speaking of Logan Paul. Logan Paul replies to Tommy in it with Tommy's been lashing out because I've been neglecting him. Sorry, I didn't chill with you, buddy. First of all, asshole. But he uh, attaches all of these screenshots of just Tommy trying to reach out and just trying to to talk and then like hang out with him and then and uh, chill with him. Logan Paul's just ignoring him. And, uh, just not wanting to hang out, but just can't say it. Tommy and it's being so polite and nice, and then Logan Paul just sends these screenshots out as if he won everything ever. And yeah, Tommy and it replies with, Why do you keep posting private messages of me being kind to you? Are, are you stupid? Uh, yeah, he is. He has holes in his brain, by the way, everyone. Logan Paul replies with, Because you beg me for attention offline, then run to Twitter when I don't acknowledge you. Another fake internet kid. First of all, all these messages you're sending and, and showing us are from a year ago. Buddy, you're more annoying now than you ever have been. Selling actual junk to children. I mean, you have been for a while, but now you're bringing out more and more and more and more. More sugar, more, more sugar. Gotta sell it all. Gotta, gotta, gotta rot these children's teeth. Gotta destroy them from the inside out. And I think this was the last straw for Tommy in it because he released a tweet that says, Now I know this might be uh, hypocritical after the past day, but I've also got my own product announced. I've been working on it for a year or two now. Introducing the Tommy in it vape by Vapely. And if you haven't watched the video, I heavily imply that you go watch it. I will link it below. You can easily go and click on it. It is a, a parody of, uh, of course, the Lunchly. The logo is the same as like the tilted E, just like the tilted C in Lunchly. And it's criticizing Logan Paul and KSI and all those people heavily for all the stuff that they're releasing. And pretty sure hitting anyone else who has released something like this too. There's even a little musical at the end. It's, it's, it's funny and hilarious, and this is the best response to a controversy I've, 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 I've ever seen in my life. This is my product. <sighs> oh. 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 This is good. Glazing here, but 
It's true. As a hater of the entire set of people that made Lunchly, this is the best response possible. I mean, the entire crew, the, the like like Logan, KSI, and Mr. Beast, they all have been getting ratioed by a bunch of people. Like Dan TDM making KSI utterly angry with just one tweet and then he just doesn't respond and just keeps posting with him and his family it's literally just dan ddm living his life while ksi is in the background trying to trying to get through to just i'm so angry at you and ksi has been trying to play it off as a joke like oh i'm just i'm just gonna keep coping just 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 trying to get my song out there uh, uh just trying to advertise all my stuff first of all your song is shit buddy this shit it's so fucking ass, bitch! Quit fucking music! Quit that shitty ass shit! Turn that shit on! Turn that trash ass fucking shit on! I'm sick of hearing that goddamn soul! I'm sick of hearing that shit! Second of all, you're a piece of shit, buddy. And yeah, Mr. Beast as well. He has a lot of controversy under his belt right now, and he's just not responding, saying that he will in time. I will! in time and people have completely forgot about the controversy because it's been so long but youtubers have been trying to, to keep it going and keep people reminded of of mr beast is uh, shitty so yeah mr beast is trying not to respond so that people just forget and he can move on which to me that was a big villain reveal all the mr beast stuff because i'm an idiot and i never knew he was a bad guy for some reason and that's that's just me i'm just a fool for that but yeah all the people that are in the Lunchly crew are getting ratioed right now. I just wanted to talk about the situation because I'm interested in it and I, and I, and I wanted to share it with you guys. I like covering drama stuff because it, it's interesting and, and it's, it's fun to, to, to watch people burn. My opinion on all this, don't buy Lunchly's, don't buy Prime, don't listen to KSI's new song, do not watch any more Mr. Beast videos, do not watch Logan Paul, do not watch KSI, ignore their existence, ignore them completely, ignore them completely. Tommy Ant's response is the best response I've ever seen, and um, yeah, that's that's it from me, I, 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 yeah. Thank you guys for watching, and I hope to see you guys next time, but in case I don't see ya, good afternoon, good evening, and... Good night. You could have opened that drawer at any time. Well, no, not any time. Only when it was funny. <laughs>